Ooh, eight and eight. A fake leader. I need to go first. I can do something like Dryad Fledgling. Traps? We got a trap! We got Crushing Trap, that's the best trap. Thanks to you, Adam, I got pro rank last season with your Brewer Traps. Yeah. But did you have fun? That's the most important part. There were many other good decks, but the Brewer Trap deck, that was the best. You guys told me all the time in the chat, the Brewer Trap deck, that's truly the best. You guys ask for it like non-stop. That's right. You enjoyed it a lot? Yeah. I enjoyed it too. Sometimes the chat said that maybe, you know, maybe we had enough Brewer Trap. We were watching it for like one month now. <laughs> and I said, that's nonsense. White frost and white light. One times a drag. Oh my god, they added the card. Ragnaros might need to be cut. This is bad. There's more points. Lever was pretty good. So this guy's just playing super generate whatever. <laughs> Leave it to us. No. I think I'm gonna play the crushing trap. Huh. We're not giving up yet. That could be a Mahakam horn. We're good. What? You're playing five out of six games against the same leader? Which leader? This leader? Panther, not Dragoon, and let's just pass. Would, it would be nice if you could play an Agitator, but it's fine. It's This is another deck, at least it seems like. It's gonna be one of those decks where we just don't care too much about uh, how we get to a uh, long ground free. We just want a long ground free, that's it. They can hide, but there is no escape. Dana everywhere. It's ridiculously fun. What can I say? Uh, well, I suppose we're gonna kick the skirmisher and the agitator. Okay, what do we want? I just don't really see, like, Sheldon Skaggs, definitely. Mm. Eh, the archer is worse. But we can get Saskia out. I can do the same thing. I don't think I'm gonna do the same thing. Uh, which role do we wanna play on? So we have a ranged lock unit. But other than that, we're good. We might want to play on the danger. 
That's fine. Dryad's fledglings are way too strong. What? These are way too strong? There are many units in the game that are free point value generators. Like, what about the elf one? That, uh, free point and shoots for one. Every turn. How are these too strong? <laughs> well, that's... He's kind of right about the panther. That's never gonna find value. can play a fledgling. Although we can play a tree hunt. Actually, I should play a tree hunt early on. This is gonna generate value. And we can always just trigger the dryads. <laughs> gonna play the tree hunt. I don't want to get out Saskia yet. We want to use that to trigger the Dryads. Sucks. But, but, but that's maybe even good for us. How much I care about boosting shell no skags? I only have one elf. Okay, now we're gonna play on the melee row. All males are your foe. The goal is to play the water of Brockelon. Actually, this shouldn't die. It's fine, so it's not dead. Water of Broccolon gets played. No! Let the dough live! And it's about damn time to do something with Dana. I play Saskia. Let's hurry. I could have played in the back. He's gonna die! Alright, Sasuke is dead. We don't have a target with Sheldon Skaggs. Over he already used his Scorch. There's nothing to really target. Actually, it seems like that he's lining up. So if he has uh, this big tree, then he won't be able to kill a uh, big Dryad now. And the next should be probably Agitator, then uh, Barnabas, then, uh, well, I guess we'll see. These two are the last. We'll pay man back for the persecution! Edge Theater is actually fairly reliable. Do you have something big? Now, this guy probably doesn't have anything big. You really saved that lock. Not sure why. Feel any burning? See a local healer or wise one. Not supposed to be 
Barnabas. He didn't boost. Actually, he did boost. Uh, maybe do you like the Great Oak? Shouldn't matter. Yeah, I'm not gonna show my last card. That could be anything. <laughs> GG! So it seems like these other Danas are, didn't really figure it out yet. Which is totally fine by me. I suppose in like two weeks, they all gonna have my, my copy-paste deck. So, GG. Actually, this is not a terrible hand. Take that. Our brothers in the vault. Katfu, can you tell us a little bit about the book? Oh. So we got Aitney again. Aitney is actually a pretty popular leader. Bunch of school kids push, pushed a girl into a well, and their fates are entangled. As they grow into adulthood. Okay, let's do a smuggler. Special prize, just for you, love. We're the best regiment in the whole plowing north! <laughs> okay, let's do the matron. And apparently if we play two matrons, we might have a pretty good uh, value generation. The first row. Let's see if this works. <laughs> I like it. Yeah, it works because it activates from left to right. From uh, first row to second row. And left to right. So it's like a Z. Okay, but he actually used up two charges, which is pretty good. So, can I push him? What would I do here? I can play this for nine, and I think that would be still acceptable. Seventeen points in two cards. Yeah, I think that's a pass. So he wants to set up a specific round three, and he didn't care too much about. Uh, well, he cared a little bit about uh, using Gateney. I think we might want to keep the archer instead of a uh, panther. Dwarf saved me. We'll pay men back for the persecution. Yep, that's pretty good. Dwarfs, what? 
But he he kind of just has like a dectoning here. He's not really committed to anything, I believe. But we'll see. Probably Scorch. The right answer is always Scorch, apparently. Uh, actually, I need to be careful. Because, well, we have a Dwarf, but we already have a Dwarf. Not the Dryad. Uh, what's gonna... Yeah, we can start with the Trian Boar, so that's fine. And I think we're gonna start with the Trian Boar. I can technically start with Saskia. Although... No, 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 no. I got an Elf, I got a Dwarf. I got a Dryad. So Saskia can just generate insane value. Yeah, I think we gotta start with the boar. It's too risky. Uh, Ithlin Egli. Sursa. That's fine. We, we have access to the whole deck. Pumpkin's Lust. It's all damage removal with tree end finisher. And Heya on, on full London trains, so very in and out. Oh, hey, Artful. Oh my god! This is Pumpkin's list? We gotta beat him now. He's my arch nemesis. So, uh, that was blown up. Can we do some Saskia value generation? It's not even. Well, if we play it, it's gonna generate two value a turn. I think we just gotta play it. And uh, maybe I have a preference for melee row a little bit. Let's hurry. Your will die. Shall be your last. Okay, let's go with that. Gotta play the dryads. Sisters, follow me. I suppose I can get at Sursa. <clears throat> Would be a pretty good way to get some value. It's a good way to guarantee that we can uh, play the Water of Broccolon. I hope deck turning becomes popular so I can bust out the old reliable Emir Mio. I hope not. I'm kind of happy with killing Bran here. Let's do that. Some things can You can get twelve points with a scorch if he has it. I don't know why people are playing 8 Nate.
This new leader is just amazing. Pretty good design. Actually, I can move that boar to limit the damage it can do. I probably want to do something like uh, Barnabas. Child on Skags. I can also move my own shell on skates in the back to a little bit make oak better. Playing the dragoon first makes more sense because we can boost it. Question is, do I want to move my unit or his unit? It's gotta be my unit. Onward, fly ahead! I never. They're getting so close to being punished. So if he pings Sheldon Skaggs, uh, we're in a big problem. This is just getting worse. I guess I could have played the Great Oak. I gotta play the Crushing Trap. Does he have a Scorch? And can I shut it down? And how would I do it? I would need to play at least a, a 12 here. No, that's not good enough. I'm just gonna assume that maybe he doesn't have a Scorch. Or he doesn't wanna play it yet. He played a 10. The likelihood that he's gonna scorch me is basically zero now. These, these games are the most intense, because you have no idea what you're up against. So, yeah. Wish I had that. That's a draw. Wow. Evenly matched. GG.